At ease, soldiers, and good morning, afternoon, or evening. Sergeant Nick Fury here with our weekly challenges on our Season 3, Week 5. We're getting down there. And as you can see, we're just going to get some tier bonuses here. I was hoping for that new leafy ghillie suit that Jay Ravens showed us on his web page there and I did a post on a few weeks ago but doesn't look like it folks unfortunately now this one's funny on the task force because it says use close quarter combat to kill Madre Coca and you know that the rebels actually kill her so I'm not sure how the hell we're supposed to go kill somebody that the rebels kill but anyways our first challenge this morning is going to be an extreme difficulty and without shooting a single bullet deploy to Tabaka Bravo then complete the mission stock drop okay so this will be interesting because I have no idea what it is because I just turned on my game and I'm gonna do this live like I said so Let's go over here to Tabaka Bravo and see what's up. And remember, I never start where you're supposed to start at. This way I make sure I get that little notification on the screen that says we've completed the first part of the challenge right there. See? Solo challenge in progress. It's very important that you get that. If you don't get that, something's going wrong. Now, one of my subscribers mentioned to me he plays on the Xbox, and he was having an issue with doing the challenges until he turned off Extreme Mode. And then he was able to complete the challenges without any issue at all. So anybody who is having that problem and hasn't been able to resolve it through Ubisoft, you might want to try that. Okay. So, let's do this mission. Stock drop. The destruction of the cocoa leaf stockpiles at the freight yard will make Madre Keiko look weak to the Cocoleros and Rebels. It will also disrupt the cartel operation in the province. I could have swore we just did this one two weeks ago. Unless I'm uh, cocoa mistaken. Cocoa leaves taken from the local farmers are stockpiled at the Tabacal freight yard for delivery. Yeah, our, did, we just did this one the like three weeks ago. That ought to oh get man, Coco's seriously, attention. dog. Yeah, I'm almost pot Yeah, this is the same one we just did. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're going to make us do the same one again? Damn, man. I should just do the same video and just change the title on it this morning, and you guys wouldn't even know that, would you? I could fake everybody out. Oh, my. Well, this one I did by just sneaking in there. It takes a little bit of time to sneak in there. Because when I shot that video for you, I had already snuck in there and did everything. And then I was standing up on the hill and then I blew everything up. So you didn't actually get to see me sneak around. Because it takes a while to do that. I don't want to waste everybody's time on the video. But I guess this morning, you're going to get to. But I'll put timestamps showing me planting the explosives. And then a timestamp you know, at the end when I blow it up. I can't believe this. They're making us do the same freaking... Come on, we got a whole 21 provinces. You guys can't come up with a better ideas, man. This is like so freaking lame. But you know why? Because they're getting ready to release player versus player open beta. Just like I said in my video a couple months ago. Remember I said the timeline was going to be they were going to test it through September. And they were going to wait for Destiny 2 to come out. Which it's out right now because everybody in a brother is streaming that crap. So... Which, you know, if you like to play that game, fine, but the graphics look very cartoonish to me, and it doesn't look that good, and, you know, get to do player versus player, might as well do it in an open world, instead of some cartoon fantasy type world, so, but anyways, you already know how we got to do this, we're going to go down the hill down there, I usually park right up above, there's going to be an old abandoned house, and that's why I park my ghosts. So this way they don't cause no frickin' trouble. Hang on, I'll drive. Doing the op. I'm in. Let's roll. Holy Christ. Yeah, I could have swore I'd seen this one. I was like, hmm, let me see. Stock drop? That mission sounds familiar, huh? Wow. Okay. It's all good, though.
But yeah, I would expect player versus player is going to come out here, if not next week, the week after. Because they got so many eggs in their basket right now with all the crap that they're doing. Because anybody watched the pack stream the other day, you know, they didn't even they didn't bother with it because why would they? Like I said, you got to look at all the games they got coming out. Assassin Creed is going to sell a lot of copies. The Crew 2, nah. It's going to be like the people who play Crew 1, like myself, we'll probably, I'll probably get it when it goes on sale. You know, just like I said, it's just a shame, man, that the, what they're doing to this game. This game has such potential, and they're just blowing it off. It's crazy, man. Doesn't make any sense to me, but that's okay. I only play the games, man, and do the videos on how to do the challenges, bro. Other than that, it's none of my business, man, what they do. Guess I gotta turn. Guess I gotta turn the radio off. Sorry. Whoops. Shit balls. My new saying. I just got the wife upset. Hey. Yeah, this is like crazy, man. Same one we already did. Wow. I can't believe this. Stay there, don't get in no trouble. While well, I'm gone. Dad's gotta go to work. Yeah, this is like nuts, man. Can't believe we gotta do this again. The drone is airborne. The signal's all bad. They're jamming the drone. No, they're not. Shut up. See? You can stay back where I'm at, get your drone up, you can still drone everything, man. Don't sweat the small stuff. Guarantee you. We've got Sicarios guarding the freight yard. And yes, I know people are going to tell me that they blew up their jammer with their HTI. I, I don't know why everybody's so excited about the HTI. I mean, really, it's like, it's only five shot. It's basically an anti-material weapon, so, you know, it's, it's can't great. can't see squat. drone's being jammed. Yeah, it is. You know, it's a great weapon for certain applications, but other than that, now I have my MSR maxed out to 30 level, I can do everything and more. I can shoot through buildings, shoot everything. So, but only unsuppressed. It is being a little bit difficult in that sense. But yeah, we've been shooting guys. We actually shot through two buildings yesterday to test it, which is sort of cool. Sort of bizarre I'm not picking up anybody down here, but no, I don't call in the um got another tango. I got a target carrying submachine guns. I don't do the rebel spotting skill. I do it all myself, man. The only thing I need Pakatari and his dudes for is yeah, every now and then we Whoa, use some support. Just target number five. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Other than that. This one down here, you got to remember there's a guy inside that building over there, too. When you go plant that one, it's up on top. But there'll be a dude in that building. So be careful. Well, there's a bunch of more dudes down there, but I ain't got time for this. Can't believe they're going to make me do this whole freaking mission again, man. Wow. Crazy, folks. I'm going to turn on my thermal because I notice when I shoot these videos, they do look okay, but... Normally, I park my guys here. If you guys are running team members, task force, your task force members can hang out in this little house right here. And then they get a view of the action. But there's only one guy down there where the um, this one is. Remember, he's moving the pallets back and forth of ammo. We'll do this one, and we'll do the one over there by the train, that one over there, and then we'll go there and do the one on the end. Coming up on the target. Damn. You can run a hell of a lot of freight through a rail yard like that. Used to be coffee beans for a Yapa Cafe back in the day. Now it's all coca all the time. We'll need to sweep the entire yard for coca stocks. 
focus on the warehouses and the main building. Because remember, there's a and guy that walks back and forth between out. these two Copy buildings that. right here. Let's get it done. So be careful you don't get spotted by him. Just can't shoot. See, he's right there. There's one right there, see? And there'll be one more. I usually have all this crap turned off, but I told you when they turn the HUD off and then you turn it back on, it def it it defaults and turns all my crap on. So it look cool. Look better if I run around with a pistol. But yeah, like I said, be careful because there is one guy over here that's moving pallets back and forth. So don't get busted by him. Where's he at? There he is right there, see? Down. They're gonna see you. I ain't gonna see shit. That guy right there, see? He's smoking right now, so. He's not working out or something. Oh yeah. Eyes on two Sicarios outside the warehouse. I just tripping on what he what what he, what he was doing. That's all. That's the guy I gotta worry about, that idiot right there. I got the C4 primed. Oh yeah, I might as well tag some supplies over here. There's a sniper up in that tower up there. guy right over here you can hear him saying be careful I got one narco at the checkpoint
watch out because there's a couple of guys right there. I know I got one more to do. Don't worry, kids. I've lost my mind. Well, I might have lost my mind, but... Now we're just sort of swing around. We're going to come in from the other side, man. I'm not going to compromise okay. myself trying to sneak through that stupid camp. Because I just watch out for the sniper. And there's another sniper down at the other end and like three or four guys walking around. And watch out for idiots on this road, because last time we did this challenge, got busted, yeah, see, by a Santa Blanca dude. I mean, by a Unidad guy. Just funny. Now, this is the one that you, right, ha you have to do individually. You can't have, you can't group up. And then everybody gets the credit for it, like last week when we did the truck, the convoy. We have to just do the papers. I was able to do that one, and then Red Scorpion got credit for it, too. But yeah, this one you're going to have to do on your own. But again, it's not that hard to do. I mean, yeah, I already know how most of the people are going to do it, unless you're a true ghost. You're going to take your time. You're going to sneak around, plant C4 like I'm doing, and blow everything up. Now watch out because there's a sniper in this tower right over here, too, so don't get busted by him. See him right there? Be careful. Come down the hillside a little bit farther that way. See him right over here. That's ten targets. And there's one walking right there, so be careful. See, we're going to go upstairs in this building right over there. And I think there's one more guy that's walking around, but that's where we're going to... I don't think there's, any, there's nobody over there for sure. This is this retard goes... I can go back up the hill and go back down and then jump that wall right there probably what I'm going to do because he doesn't look like he's he might take his time so with moving just don't get stuck in the rocks that would suck <laughs> oh yeah and occasionally that happens you'll we can guys one time we had the rebels drive right through because that road goes right through the middle of the base and then they attacked and it was had a big throw down so that was a good distraction so you, you can call in rebel support and they'll get into big tizzy with these guys if you want to do it that way
Yeah, see, that's where you're going right there. So be careful. And there's the other stash right up there. And usually there's a guy in that building right there, too, so... Okay, so once you get across here, like I said, I climb over the wall right there. Yo, cartel gun. The brain. I had a little glitch with my video, unfortunately. So I had to hit stupid ATI Relive decide to stop working, but I got it work. I got it running again here. So. What I did is I came down that hill where you saw me where I started to glitch. I was right over there. And I brought my ghosts over there and one of the idiots got ran over by the train like always. And then you jump over that wall, you jump over this fence, and then you just have to come into this building that I showed you and come upstairs. And this is the last one right here. It's right here. So. That was hilarious. Demo's primed and in place. I just getting ready to go to the th thing, and I get that stupid little window thing pops up saying, this program has stopped working. Would you like us to look for a solution? And I'm like, no, not in the middle of shooting my video, man. That's the worst time for you to stop working, dude. You retard. So. I'm just trying to figure out where these guys are at right here so I can jump off of here uh, without getting spotted. Hey, you got run over by the train, idiot. What a ding dong. Yeah, because there might be a guy in this building who came back in this building. I can't be sure when I was upstairs, all the excitement. Oh, it was nighttime when we started this op, so better to do it at night. If you can do it at night, that's great. Not, you're gonna have to be very extra stealthy here. Hey, where's that? Hang in there, I'm coming your way. Oh, screw him. He got run over by the train on his own. Yeah, you gotta watch out for that dude right there. Come on, dude, keep walking. My Chihuahua wanted to go that way. I'm gonna have to go down this way. Target's marked. Standing by for cold order. Yeah, we just go down here and blow it. So there you go. You got your three charges planted. Nobody's the wiser. Watch out, because what happened was is when I moved over to this other side, those idiots. One of them said, oh, we're too far apart, or, you know, we're losing, losing our cohesionness, or whatever he said. So that's why they started to move on their own, because I did park them over on the other side over there. But there you go, your three charges are planted. Once you do that, move off to a safe distance, blow them things. First coca stock destroyed. Let's move on to the next. Target down. There you go, Target ghost. Stock. There's your solo challenge. In those stocks. One completed. Didn't have to fire a shot. Didn't have to call in rebel support. Didn't have to blow up the jammer. Didn't have to do none of that crap. Okay. So now you can go ahead and kill people. Come on, dude, stick your head up there. Solid copy. Oh, remember That's I was showing you that. Uh, let me show you this real quick before I get myself killed. They can pretty much shoot through buildings with this thing pretty damn good. Man down, yo, man down. Don't make a liar out of me. Went to take off my suppressor. I threw another damn charge on the ground. But 
that was an easy challenge. We're doing it when the sun's coming up, man. Look at how beautiful it looks today. So, until I do challenge number two here. Move out over here so I won't get, not to worry about getting killed. Sergeant Nick Fury. At ease, soldiers. 